Right, good afternoon YouTube. It's Nick the Gardener here with a courgette chocolate cake recipe which I got from, that's what I call the Good Life channel. So sorry, I'll try and get in. So the ingredients are 350 gram of self-raising flour, 50 gram cocoa powder, one table sorry teaspoon of mixed spice I didn't have any mixed spice but I looked at the ingredients what it was and it was like ginger coriander seed cinnamon cloves nutmeg mace and all spice I think something like that but I didn't have them so I just made it what I could uh, a teaspoon of salt so all the ingredients from the uh, spices I put there in with the salt I just need to sieve that before I put it in there because it might have a few husks from the coriander seeds. Uh, next we have 75ml of oil, 375 grams of caster sugar, 2 teaspoons of vanilla extract and 140 grams of hazelnut which is optional, oh sorry and also 3 eggs. So uh, yeah, you basically mix all the ingredients, oh wait, well, no. I forgot the most important ingredient, so 500 ml level, so 500 ml, not 500 gram or anything, um, just in a measuring jug like that. So first, you need to sieve all the dry ingredients into a bowl, and while I'm doing this, the oven's on 160 at the moment, and I've already pre-lined baking tins. So that's a self raising flour, cocoa powder, The mixed spice, and what I did with all the coriander seeds and the whole cloves, I just ground those up in the uh, pestle and mortar first. So then we add sugar, three eggs which have already been beaten. and uh, 75 ml of oil I'll start to give that a good mix around now bring it all together better not forget the vanilla extract let's get two teaspoons of this It's good for you. <laughs> so yeah, keep mixing this together. And then, once it starts to come together a bit, we add all the courgette and the work. So it took about four medium sized courgettes for this recipe and uh, I had to do something to get rid of the courgettes because basically I was getting inundated with courgettes and I've still got three left in the fridge. So yeah, once this is all nicely mixed together We'll pop it into the two pre lined tins. Now, 
and you could measure it to make sure you get half and half not measure it so you weigh it but I'm not that, I'm not that perfect and bothered about it just get it in there and it although you do want to get them quite close because otherwise one might like, cook more than the other but if one is more bigger than the other you put that on the top and put the small one on the bottom and it should help to cook about the same so just going to pop these in the oven on 160 degrees celsius gas mark 3 for about 30 to 40 minutes so i'll check it after 30 minutes and then pop it back in if it's if it needs it all right thank you bye bye so welcome back it's about an hour later and it took 35 minutes in the oven and uh, stabbed them with a knife and the knife came out clean so that means that they're done I just waited a little bit of time for them to cool down in that meantime I made some buttercream so let's give it a go icing it so I've never done this before but apparently using a something with a hot knife is well, makes it spread easier so it's about 500 grams of caster sugar 80 grams I think of cocoa powder 200 grams of butter and uh, you, then you just keep adding milk until it gets nice and fluffy so let me get this right to the edge if I can Put a bit more. It's nice to have a nice bit of juicy filling in a cake, especially chocolate. Right, I think that'll do for that bit. Now this other top layer. Let's see if we can get it on okay. Almost right. There we go. So yeah, with the butter icing, you just mix all the ingredients together and just, you know, it's nice and smooth and spreadable, like cement. I feel like a, a builder with a trowel. Might have enough to pretty much cover the whole cake, I reckon. I think the cake might still be a bit too warm. But you know what? I'm quite happy with that. Let's see if we can get a bit more out of it. Yeah, so there we have it.
chocolate courgette cake. <laughs> courgette cake. Oh, sorry. And the finishing touches, nasturtium flowers. Thank you very much for watching. Please give it a thumbs up if you like it, or thumbs down if you don't. Thank you very much for watching. Cheers. Goodbye.